Hello guys, I just thought that I'd start the vlog because we're getting our windows done tomorrow, just the ones on the back of the house because I explained before but I think it was the last vlog that when we stopped trying to climb up and um, the windows on the front of the house are newer than the ones on the back of the house <laughs> so we're just doing the ones on the back of the house, the one in the kitchen and the one in the bedroom upstairs. Now we're thinking we might just do the ones in the porch as well. <laughs> So we're gonna get a quote I think when they're here tomorrow but they literally rang a few days ago and said they come on Tuesday. Obviously it was a while ago when they came and gave us a quote and everything and then they had to put in the order for the windows and then they must have been ready so they're able to do them on Tuesday. I think because it probably won't take that long it's they're coming like that like lunchtime so it'll be grand hopefully they won't take too long. I'm excited I hope it makes the house warmer. There's definitely a difference since we got the house insulated so it was so worth it excuse all the washing in the background i just folded it by the way um but yeah the house is definitely a lot warmer it's so much better if you're thinking about getting your house um insulated i would definitely recommend doing it so good we just well we didn't get our house insulated that's a whole different job so much bigger we just literally got the attic insulated with spray foam and it was really quick and easy it took like an hour and a half i think and it has made a difference for sure. We put on our heating like once a day and that's literally it. Um, and it's not bad at all, it's quite warm. So yeah, I have a few bits that I wanna show you that I picked up in town yesterday. So yeah, we went to the Nespresso shop because we needed some more coffee pods. So I'll show you the ones we got some of them are really exciting. Um, and I also got this mug in just like a random shop in the Stephen's Green shopping center. I think they have similar in deals, but I wasn't sure if I'd be able to get my hands on them. Do you know how these things sell out so quickly? So it was like seven years, so I just picked it up. So cute though. Pumpkin, obviously. Um, so yeah, I got that basically to have my pumpkin spice cake. Nespresso, I, or Nespresso coffee in it. These are really big mugs and usually I don't like a big mug because I don't like the full mug to be filled. Basically with the Nespresso Virtuo, you can get different sized ones so you can get different mugs like like a small like espresso size or like another there's another two i think in between that are both quite good to have milk um because i like i like a milky coffee like especially when i'm having one like this i just find them too strong otherwise um so yeah but the guy in the shop was telling me that you can just press the button to stop it whenever you want so yeah i don't know if the rest of it just goes to waste them though at least I can have <laughs> not a full coffee. I wonder if you could just like keep it and then have the rest later. That would be kind of cool, wouldn't it? You get like two out of one. But um, yeah, I've got pumpkin spice cake. So I'm going to, I think, try one of these out now in my pumpkin mug. <laughs> I'm just so excited about it. I've literally, the mug is only out of the dishwasher. And then um, Con got some. He just likes black coffee. He loves an espresso machine though. He literally has like at least one coffee a day from it I'd say and um he just got Stormio because he likes that one he tried it for two um boxes up there. and then he got a four tado because he likes those ones he doesn't really like any of the like flavours or anything he just likes like normal um and then this one oh my god I'm so excited for it chocolate fudge flavour are you serious so yeah again that's another big mug all the good flavours there's actually loads in there that I want to try in the bigger mugs because I usually don't get them because they're in the bigger mugs and then it ends up too strong for me. But if I can just press the button, like you said, and not fill the mug completely and have room for some nice milky, then it's a game changer because I want to try loads of them. There's like a something, it's like some vanilla custard cookie or something like that. And then there's like another one as well. That sounds really good. I think it's like a caramel something one as well so yeah very excited so this is the machine that i have it's a virtuo i have it since probably 2020. look at the vibes well the orange so cute first i need to stock up this 
Connor already put all of his boxes of these and then I was like, please, I want to do a haul. Um, and this, these are some older ones as well that Con didn't like that much. There's like a hazelnut muffin one and stuff though that I would definitely like. I just thought it was too big for me. So, what a treat. I'm just thinking, yay, this window will no longer be steamy AF when we get a new one because this is ancient, this one. <laughs> Pumpkin ones are so cute, they're orange with little leaves on them. <laughs> oh my god, these chocolate fudge ones are so cute as well. Now I just want to try them as well. And I can't. <laughs> I can't have two coffees at once. But autumn vibes all together. I'm gonna make the jar autumnal and do the fudge and pumpkin. They might not all fit in, but I'll do some because there's already those kind of colours in here, so it's perfect. And then I'll do this little basket with cons ones in it. His are more dark. It's like that dark green, which is actually kind of cool. It's like dark greyish khaki. They get nice together. Well done, con for a play. I don't care about the scene. I don't care about the location. All that matters not to me. That you wherever I go, baby. I just need you by my side. I forgot I really like these Bianco Forte ones. Actually, Con drinks them more because they're the bigger ones. I prefer the smaller ones that are like a blondy kind of colour. That's how I describe them. Um, they're called Bianco Leggero, I think. And they didn't have any in stock the other day, so that's why we didn't get them. But these are all nice as well. I think Con likes these ones. Why is there a new one, these ones? But anyway, these ones are a fario. Yeah, that's one of the well known ones. And then these are the hazelnut. Hazelino muffin. Delish. Ever since you found me, we're the only thing I see. Forever and a day, it's you and me. And they can replicate this unity. No pressure. I can see I'm watching and they try to do better. But you one in a million, you ain't average. Girl, I promise I'm gonna have you living lavish. Take a trip, girl, we're about to vanish. Cause I'll go anywhere, anywhere. Just as long as you're with me. Cause girl, I know that you get me. So I'll go anywhere. About the way they're looking at us, cause I know they wish they had it, and you know we doing damage to the game. I don't care about the stereotype, I can never do it, mono we the stereotype. I'm talking left, right, link. I'm talking left. Guys, let's do taste test. Imagine it was horrible. That smells really nice. It smells like, it smells kind of festive, like you can smell the like spice to get me. Mm, that's nice. That's nice. I'm not sure that it's sweet enough for me though. I might have to add sweetener. I always have sweetener in my coffee, so. That's nice, it's really warm as well. Stuff like, what a treat, guys. Woo, yay. Cheers. <laughs> okay, let's do befores of the windows because it's now Tuesday. <laughs> so, we're getting new windows later on. We're just I'm up there and the kitchen. And from the inside. Mm -hmm. There's all the wood that came out of one window. And now they're just starting on the one in the kitchen. So just from the one upstairs, like, are you kidding me? Me and the boys are going for a walk to get out of their way while they're doing it. Fingers crossed. It won't take long. Guys, I can't cope. I don't know if I told you on the vlog or where it was or if I told you at all. But a good few months ago, Bob weed on Honey's head by mistake when we were out for a walk. That's Bob. By the way, he literally thinks he's like on a mission to go as fast as he possibly can. So he's like literally not able to breathe. He's exhausted and moving out for about two minutes. But anyway, it won't stop him. It won't slow him down. He could honestly go for a 10 hour walk and still not slow down his pace, I swear. But honey, come on. Yeah, so Bobby, anytime he does a wee now, honey has a heart attack. This is honestly, God, it was when we only just got honey, so it's at least a year ago, I'd say, when he weed on her head by mistake. Basically, she moved <laughs> underneath him while he was weeing, and then he weed on her head, <laughs> all over her hair, like into the curls, and honey hated it so much that 
she now panics every single time he does wee and she's she like <laughs> she stops like ages back from him and doesn't go near him until he stopped it's so funny <laughs> well next time he does one i'll try to record it but he's just done a few already so don't know if he'll be able to go again guys i walked past the cutest pumpkins in the little fruit and veg shop down in the town beside us um when i was walking the dogs so i'm gonna go now i'm gonna go to the gym so i'm here as well go in and get um some pumpkins while i have the car <laughs> how cute look at the pumpkins are out <sighs> Oh, oh, I Yay! I mean, it's obviously dark, but it still just feels brighter and more open in here. It's weird. Ah, it's time for a window reveal. Guys, I don't know why, but it just makes the room feel brighter, even though it's the same size window. There's just no bits in between it. It's, But it just feels much brighter and bigger. I don't know and I feel like you can even see more outside maybe it's because it's not constantly steamed up like the old one now you can see how messy the back garden is <laughs> now much the grass needs to be cut but love it I'm delighted and we've got some more pumpkins going on in here so the paint got a bit scratched off we used to have blue tiles but we painted them white <laughs> in case you weren't here when we did that but yeah we're gonna have to just go over that we have some spray paint anyways these are just little flowers in the garden and here is the upstairs one. I can't remember if I actually already showed you or not, but you just need to paint the wood around it and stuff. Yeah, gorge. So much brighter in here. Guys, it's got delivered to my parents and I'm only getting to open it now. I haven't got a Pixie M um, package in ages. I love their stuff so much, especially their skincare. They do makeup and stuff as well, but their, like, which is really good, but they're skincare is just i love it so so much i've tried like literally everything in it and anything i've been gifted that i liked i've bought myself a few times like there's a lot of things that i've bought um and that i would buy so this one is botanical collagen collection which hello collagen like please come here um so this is collagen tonic and then it comes with three face masks, which I'm very, very happy about. I really, oh, I'm in the mood to do a face mask. I was only thinking that earlier. I cannot remember the last time. I cannot remember the last time. I feel like my face is just so dry. So this would be absolutely perfect. I'd say Con would be up for doing one he loves. Oh, these are different steps. You do the tonic and then your mask and then your eyes and your lips. <gasps> I'm going to do that later. Fully going to do it later. Oh, so these are all in each mask. So it's three masks that are the same. So they all have hyaluronic acid peptides and botanical collagen unreal i look so young and like just like i like i've got so much elasticity in my skin i feel like i don't have that really my skin's gone downhill in the last while i swear to god turning 25 is no absolute joke i swear i'm 26 now in the last year i've noticed wrinkles i've just noticed i'm just i'm not looking so hot then again i don't do much to look after my skin but i don't really wear makeup or anything so like i don't know but anyway i moisturize like every day and that's it and i wash my face with soap in the shower like dove soap um anyway and then eye serum i love i love i'm like addicted to eye cream and serums now like i don't know how i used to not wear eye cream eye cream <laughs> my eyes are so dry without it now i'm like it's like how i'm used to wearing like moisturizer in my face but i feel like i used to avoid my eyes because i think i got like these little dots i can't remember the name of them little like lumps under my eye and it's apparently from moisturizing but obviously with eye cream you wouldn't get that it was for, from like using too rich moisturizers and stuff around my eyes never really got rid of them but they haven't got any worse i feel like or else i'm just used to them now but i definitely i definitely haven't got any more anyway since using eye cream so yeah this is um an eye serum which i'm very excited for and this is a lip gloss oh i love a lip gloss especially a good one and you know all the crap ones like i, I still wear all the crap ones like Carmex and stuff but I feel like they just like wreck your lips do you know what I mean like you become like addicted to them kind of so yeah I'm really excited I love a good lip gloss and we're well I'm we're talking like about lip balms but I feel like this is kind of like a bit of both you know the best of both worlds <laughs> the best of both worlds but yeah I'm very excited I love any sort of gloss lip like I just love especially ones that I go for you kind of like I actually have um 
to Charlotte Tilbury College in Lip Bath and I'm obsessed with them. So I wonder if there's any colour in it or what is going on. It's just like a nice clear. Yeah, lovely and clear. Phenomenal. Don't mind the state of me, I'm just be talking to the shower now, but put it on. It's like a really nice thick lip balm kind of vibe. But it's very it's nice and shiny, it is glossy. I'd probably say it's like a hybrid between lip balm and lip gloss. Unreal. Guys, I just was looking at this more and it actually says ow. Oh, um it actually says volumizing lip balm underneath so it is like a lip gloss slash lip balm i'm a genius guys we still have the table someone's come to pick it up so we're clearing out there's loads of drink underneath it we're gonna get a nice shelf for up there and then we'll hopefully get around to making the new table and stills today and stuff to show you but yeah bye bye table i do like it it's just very big so we'll be sad to see it go on this definitely an improvement you know he's already chopped the cushion already chopped the cushions and stuff and like fair play it's so much better than it was before he definitely put effort in you know hmm. i'm happy with that not perfect but pretty good big improvement to be honest and my pajamas and dinner is just ready i'm so excited to eat it it's a roast <laughs> So cute, this just arrived. I love it so much. I'm obsessed with Pixie Glow Tonic, it's so nice. I'm obsessed with every single one of their products that I've tried. And they say my name, so I love them even more. Hi, Hi. 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 Hi.